So what is good guys Adnan here showcasing to you our picks for the top 5 minimal android games that are amazingly to the point but also do not get boring with time. Let's have a look at them. Alright, so the first game on our list is Mars Mars and apart from its weird name, the gameplay itself is pretty satisfactorily weird. Let me explain, you are a space traveler and you get to play with more than 50 characters, each with their own design level themes and even sounds. Playing the game itself is super simple, you just try to land on the platforms one by one safely. As you progress, the game gets harder and harder and as you can probably see the platform level I am on, I am addicted. If I was pressed on to find a flaw with the game, I'd say that it gets repetitive, especially after jumping through 500 platforms. But the new character unlocks just totally crush the only drawback it has. Missiles is a game full of speed, responsiveness and frustration. You fly a plane on a screen by either using the joystick or scrubbing through the entire screen or even using the left and right arrows. The aim is simple, dodge the missiles and try not to throw your phone everywhere when you lose. The game has two modes and if for some reason you found the already pretty fast normal mode to be easy, then the fast mode is for you. Oh and you also do get some power ups like a shield and boost here and there. This game just screams minimalism everywhere. Before we begin talking about the game, this game has basically an endless amount of beautifully designed levels. To get through each level, you need to forge all the sides of the minimal shapes and two taps for the same sides and you lose. It sounds simple, is simple and the game sound is just a pleasure to hear too. Well that's all this game packs, no extra things, no purchases for some weird additions, it's all just pure fun and we bet you love it. Up next is something crazy with a dope set of 8-bit graphics. Just like Mars Mars, Rush Fight 2 is a game with only 2 tap controls and it's extremely easy. Or is it? You basically strike your way past a series of people trying to hit you with the last move and you tap in the direction where your death is more closer. The game starts off easy and as your coordination builds up, so does the intensity of the game. Rush Fight has a plethora of purchases that you can make with in-game money, like different characters and a ton of weapons to choose from. Again, very much like the first game on our list, every character has its own theme and the music so good, it comes to life. We wanted to end our list by showcasing my personal favorite minimal game, Smashy Road. Again, with super cute 8-bit graphics, the game never gets old. The objective? Smash into everything, gain wanted levels, get tougher competition from the police squad trying to take you down, and finally get wrecked. A personal opinion that I'd like to throw in that makes this game a lot fun is the pace you play at. It is fast and requires not really a lot of attention. Simple, quick and fun checks all the requirements to be crowned the best minimal game of all time. Rounding off today's episode, I would love to hear what your favorite minimal games are. That's been it, this is Adnan from TrueTech signing off and I'll catch you guys in the next episode.